hello guys hello guys welcome and welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing okay thank you so much for always supporting your girl so guys today i'm wearing my favorite dress i really wish i could show you the whole dress it's super super nice so i'm feeling so happy feeling good the day was awesome i did my work and finished it today a half of it yeah and guess what tomorrow is a holiday so i'm really happy i'm going to enjoy my long long holiday and i'm going to drop this video very late because there were some hiccups here and there but regardless i have to drop a video because i promised myself that i'm going to be very very consistent i'm going to drop a video every day if not after every two days so guys hmm, thank you so much for supporting your girl i believe we are going to hit those 10,000 subscribers this year. I believe, I believe. With hard work and consistency and you guys subscribing, liking and sharing, we are definitely going to achieve it. So guys, today I'm going to do a very simple video. What are those childhood stories you used to believe when you were so young that when you're looking at them now that you're grown, you laugh and laugh at yourself actually that you believed in them. It could be either something you read in your story books. It could be something your parents shared with you or your great grandparents shared with you or your or your neighbors or anyone so for me i'm going to shelf one <laughs> some of them they used to be so funny now that i'm looking at them now I, I laugh so much so guys when i was young i used to believe that uh if you whistle at we used to be told that if you whistle at night you invite snakes into your home and i used to believe that man i couldn't even whistle because we, we believed if you whistle at night, like you invite uh, snakes to your home. So it was super, super scary. You couldn't whistle at night. Or if you whistled, you, 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 you could just pray to God that snakes will not come to, our, to your home. Also, another story I, I used to believe that, um, I used to believe that zombies are real. I don't know if they are real actually, till now. <laughs> That's the funniest part of it. I really don't know if they are real or fake. But I used to believe that if you watch those zombies in the movies, they will come out of the movies and attack you at night when you are sleeping. I also used to believe that Santa is real. Like during Christmas, when we could just set up the Christmas tree and all the gifts would be arranged there, I used to wake up thinking, actually, it is Santa who has brought those gifts. Like literally, like I believe there was Santa until I was like almost 12 years old. Man, when you're kids, I, I feel like we are very dumb and you believe anything you are told. I also, also used to believe that. <laughs> I used to believe that if you chew chewing gum and you just swallow it, it, that it will grow in your stomach. Okay, that's what you used to be told. So I used to believe that if you chew your chewing gum and you swallow it, then it's going to grow in your stomach. <laughs> We also used to believe that if you eat the banana, the twin bananas, I don't know if you guys know, when you buy those bananas and they are held together, the twin bananas, if you eat those twin bananas, then in the future, if you're going to have kids, you're going to have twins. And I used to believe this. So anytime I could see those twin bananas, I could cry if someone, someone told me to eat those bananas or I could just run away or stop eating any banana. I felt like I would have twins, but now that I'm an, ad an adult, I don't mind twins, and I eat those bananas because I don't believe you will have twins because you eat twin bananas. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. I also used to believe that um, like Satan is real. I used to believe that Satan is real because we, be, we used to be told that if you do wrong, then Satan will come at night and bite you. So when we were young, you could just not disobey your parents. You couldn't just move wrongly. Because we believe that if you do something wrong, then you're going to be sent to Satan. And we believe that Satan lived on earth and Satan is going to bite you. <laughs> now, that, now that I'm looking at it, can you imagine? <laughs> that Satan was going to bite you. Why, oh my God. We used to believe when we were... We are young, you used to believe on super, super stories. Also, as Africans, we used to believe that when you when you eat something, you have to, to drop like a little bit on the ground. I used to see like some of my uncles doing it because they believed, my older uncles, they used to do it because they believed that um, 
you bless you when you pour the food on the floor then you are a sense that uh, you get to feed your ancestors that's what i used to believe hey my god also i used to we used to believe that um the ghosts in the movies were real like we could watch the movies and cry literally because we felt like this person is being oppressed in the movie so we felt like it was real like personally i would cry because I, I used to ask myself why this person uh why is this person uh maltreating this person so much so i used to cry thinking it's li- real like i couldn't differentiate between the movie and reality so i used to cry so much when i see someone is suffering okay so, sometimes even when i'm an adult when i see something being so unfair on movies i cry not because that i believe it's real but because of those emotions i don't know who else cries when they're watching movies if you cry when you're watching movies kindly comment below so that i know i have my fellow people who are so emotional <laughs> ah, so guys i also saw someone um uh the other day saying they used to they, they used to they used to believe that um like the usa is in another part of the world not like on earth i used to believe that so i used to believe that usa is also in a, is located in another let's say another planet not on earth that's when i was young very young so i used to believe that um yeah usa is located in another uh planet not like art with us i felt like they were far far away from us but nowadays i things have changed yeah so guys um there are so 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 many so many beliefs but i'm trying to remember other there's so so many we also used to believe that um if you eat so fast then you get fat i don't know how true is this I, we, we used to be told that we should eat with the table manners that we should eat slowly because we, we used to be told that if you eat very fast then you become fat i don't know how true it is is it true if you eat very fast then you become fat i really don't know about this it could be true i'm not so sure so i'm not going to back up this one i because i don't believe i don't believe it do you get fat by eating faster i don't i don't know i don't know we also used to be told that um when we were kids that um when you when you see there was there was this uh green green insect that when it flies around to your home that day you are going to eat meat is it true i don't think it applies that if you see that green grasshopper it used to be like a grasshopper that you see if you see it flying around your whole house that day you are going to eat meat that's when meat was not affordable you remember the the early 2003 2004 yeah life was very hard that time actually right now it's very hard but that time it was when you could afford um you could afford uh, like meat that used to be like the richest time of your home because you can actually afford meat we also used to believe that um okay i'm someone who used to eat meat a lot like i love meat I love meat so much. I cannot deny that. So the best way my mom could do to keep me away from stealing meat from the pot, she could just tell me that if you eat that meat from the pot when it's not well cooked, it will get stuck on your throat. So any time I used to believe that. So any time she could tell me, "Look after that meat." I would be tempted to eat, to just take a piece and eat. But then I could hear her voice in my head saying, If you eat that meat then you are going it's going to be stuck on your throat and i could just i could just avoid tasting the meat from the pot now that i'm looking at it I'm, i was so foolish i could believe anything someone could tell me i also used to believe that remember the soaps we used to watch if you watch like some of our paradise there was this one that had also i don't know there was so popular popular soap operas we used to watch in movies like i used to believe they were real like i used to believe those are real life stories of people i used to cry and then they w- they used to be so popular every time you go to school and everyone is discussing about this soap opera so i felt like they were so real now that i know they were just soap operas i feel like oh my god my old childhood was, was a lie it was a lie and then also the common thing we used to believe that um when you go to school you come out of school then you're going to make money you become rich actually that's also another lie i used to believe when i was young so guys that's all for today and if i find more stories i used to believe when i was young i will share with you guys also guys 
just share your stories share what you used to believe in the comment section maybe we can brainstorm and laugh at it thank you so much for watching always thank you for the support let's get to our 10,000 subscribers see you on the next one love you guys bye